Hi and welcome to Violet Connie Art. Today's video is a Mother's Day present. So my son actually got this for me, some pouring medium and some high flow acrylic paints. I have never tried doing pouring acrylic paints before. So this is really was really fun for me because I had wanted to try it. He picked some really nice colors, a like teal color and a purple and a white as well as whatever that pouring medium stuff is. And he also picked the picture frames to, for, for me to be able to uh, pour paint all over. He got a little bit of assistance from the person in the art shop and um, let him know how to do it. And he was explaining I needed 75% of the pouring medium and then 25% of the paint. And then I could pour it over the picture frame, which I think I will eventually put in a picture of him in definitely I don't actually show that at the end because I just did this all in one day and um, it's still not quite dry yet but I do show uh, what it looks like at the end I had originally recorded the voiceover for that first section while I was talking about the items but I don't know where the audio went something bizarre happened and it only had the first very small chunk and then it disappeared but anyway so what I did I started out by using some gesso that I had already and coated the whole entire thing in gesso and then I started doing the pouring so I put a bit of the pouring medium in each cup and then I put a little bit of the high flow acrylics into each and then I kind of just spoon it onto the frame and mush it around at the very end I put the hair dryer on it which made it kind of crack a bit and I really like that effect um and yeah I had a lot of fun with this today this was definitely my first time trying this, so I probably made a lot of mistakes and anyone who usually paint pours and has done this before is probably saying, no, don't do it like that. But I really enjoyed it and it was kind of relaxing to do and I really liked the final outcome. I, in the end, hit it with a hairdryer trying to get it to dry quickly, but it's still really quite wet at the moment. Um, and it kind of made this surface crack, which I really liked the look of as well. The other thing that I might have changed up was maybe paint the surface first so that it had a bit of wet on it so that the paints flowed a bit easier. Uh, it kind of left the gessoed surface a lot and so I really had to kind of smush it a lot to get it to cover the entire surface. But other than that, I really like how it turned out. I'm not a huge fan of the really, really messy art, like the cleanup afterwards and the paint on my hands was really a lot for me. And so I'm going to try and figure out a better way to do it next time so I don't make quite such a huge mess. But yeah, I'm looking forward to putting a lovely picture of my son into this and he did a great job in choosing me a wonderful Mother's Day gift. I'm going to put some music on now and uh, just leave it to for the rest of the video and enjoy. And if you you know like my video don't forget to like and maybe subscribe if you want to see some more and thank you so much for watching bye